Hey, does this shirt look bad on me? Yeah, it's hideous on you. I really hope that my soulmate has never lied too. Yeah, I don't think that it's a good thing. You have no friends because you're so brutal. I have friends. Your squishmallows don't count. Bestie, have you heard the rumor? No, what rumor? Well, I heard that. Ladies, no talking. I'll have to separate you. You can't switch our seats. I have social anxiety and she's the only one that I like. You should have thought about that before disrupting the whole class. Go sit with Jack. Ugh. Oh, can I please sit somewhere else? He smells so bad. You know I can hear, right? I don't even smell. I showered like two days ago. Sorry, that was a little bit brutal. Yeah, you think? So, where are you from, Stinky? Um, I was born in, uh, Maryland, yeah. What part of Maryland? The one where they catch the crabs. That's definitely not true. Who fucking cares anyway? I can lie if I want to. Oh, wait, Annie sounds kind of cute. I could go with that. So what name did you get? Oh, it says Annie Rection. Bailey, are you serious? I think you need to read that one more time. What? What do you mean? Do you hear what you're saying? Annie Rection. <gasps> oh! Decline! Oh my god, I can't believe I almost accepted that. You need to figure out how to read, apparently. Whatever. Remember, you can only decline two times. I know, but the next one has to be better than that. Yeah, you better hope so. Ben. I mean, that's usually a boy's name, but I could go by Ben. What is it this time? Ben Dover. Girl, you have got to be kidding me, right? Not again. Oh, hey, Amanda. Yeah, that's not my name anymore. It's Taylor Swift now. That's the name you got? Yeah, isn't it awesome? What did you get? You don't want to know. Please be good. PP time. I don't want to be called PP. Sis, please tell me there's another way to change my name. There is, but you're not going to like it. Tell me how to change my name. I can't be called PP time forever. The only way that you can change your name now is to go and steal one from someone else. What? I'm not doing that. I knew you would say that. What happens if I just hit the decline button again? No, no, you cannot do that. Why not? Because your name will be completely randomized. It might be better. Or it could be like way worse. Fine, how do I steal a name? All you need to do is slap someone in the face and their name transfers over to you. Hey, Taylor. Oh, hey, girl, what's going on? Dude, why did you just slap me? You said that would work. Okay, I was just kidding. I didn't know you were really going to do it. <clears throat> Sorry, I think your only choice is just to hit decline. Okay. Please. Mike Hunt. Whoa, I'm sorry. What did you just say? Mike Hunt. That's what it says. Do you hear yourself? Mike Hunt. I can't even say that with a straight face. You should have took pee pee time. I know that now. There has to be someone I can talk to to fix this. Try going to their headquarters here. Hi, I'm- Take a ticket and wait in the line. Your number will be called. Okay. Number 69, Mike Hunt. Please don't call me that. So, what seems to be the problem? All of the names that I got were prank names. That's odd. Was it every name you got? That is definitely not right. We'll fix it for you. Really? Amazing. According to our database, someone hacked into your name system. Why would someone do that? To block you from getting your true identity. Have you met your family before? I live with them? No, I mean like your birth family. I'm sorry to tell you this, but I think you were kidnapped as a kid. What? What are you talking about? Well, you look exactly like Queen Meredith did when she was young. Okay, and a lot of people look alike. It's uncanny, but the whole family died in a car accident. Princess Sophia is still alive. Yes, but I believe that you are her. No, the system already gave that name away to the girl who it belonged to. That's what I'm trying to tell you. It didn't belong to her. It belongs to you, and that's why they blocked it. What? But why would someone want to steal my identity? To uncover the fortune of the royal family. How much money are we talking about? Seven billion dollars. We have to stop them, right? Today we want you to go home and do not say anything. Why would I do that? Because we're gonna come take care of it. Hey, sweetheart, I'm so sorry about the terrible name you got. It's fine, I can just make a nickname. FBI, open up! Quick, grab Sophia, we need to get out of here right now. Ugh, my mouth tastes like salmon. Who eats fish for breakfast? Oh my god, I don't think that's fair. Why are you chugging water like a toddler? Are you okay? No! I think my soulmate's doing something that I really don't want to be a part of. What could they possibly be doing? Never mind. I thought this was cherry. Why does it taste alcoholic? Who does shots at 2 p.m., bro? Get a grip! <coughs> <coughs> oh my god. Please don't tell me that was the devil's lettuce. Is my soulmate Chuck Bass? I'm so confused. 
Your soulmate is really putting you through it, huh? I am going through it and I'm afraid of what's next. My soulmate just ate mochi, it was so good. Oh, this one's really weird. It tastes like, um, like metal a little bit. Why would they eat metal? Oh my God. Sis, did you forget to flush the toilet again? It stinks. She's not even home. What is that? Do they live on a farm? Oh, why does it smell like that? I'm just gonna do this for the rest of the day. Hey guys, what's up? Dude, why are you plugging your nose like that? You don't wanna know. You can't just hold your nose for the rest of the day. Yes, I can, and I will. I won't talk to you if you keep doing that. Ugh. I regretted that immediately. What are you freaking out about? It smells like pee. It's not your soulmate's fault. They're probably just walking outside. But I have to deal with it too. Not the fish again. Oh, I know what they're doing. They're a freak, what the f I can't do this anymore. Ah, oh, why is it spicy? You are being so dramatic. I'm gonna throw up. Headphones, what? I don't want these. Wait, did these let me hear what my soulmate is hearing? I love being nosy. The total today for your hemorrhoid cream is 100. I don't think I was supposed to hear that conversation. Maybe it'll be better this time. Bro, did you ever get that crazy rash on your ass figured out? I think I'm gonna put these away. My soulmate was looking at engagement rings for me. An engagement ring? But you haven't even met yet. I heard him tell the seller he was buying it for his soulmate. So has your soulmate said anything fun? I don't know, I haven't put them on yet. Are you crazy? Put them on right now. You have to hear what they're doing. Okay. Oh yeah, baby, that's the spot. Ah! What, what were they saying? Is it bad? I gotta go, I'm gonna go wash out my ears with bleach. <laughs> really, that's it? Who even cares? It's just hair. This game is such a joke. Sis, can I do something for a task? Yes, but why do you have scissors? I need to cut your hair. Why would you need a piece of my hair? Hmm, I don't know. That's creepy. <laughs> Why would I do that? I mean, if it wants me to, I will. Where are you going with my hair? Uh, don't worry about it. It's a task. The last 10 are the hardest. Be careful. I'm really not worried about that. DNA results will be back in three days. Okay, thank you. Hi, um, I'm here for my results. You're the girl from three days ago. Come with me to the back. Why? I'll tell you when we're back there. Listen, you are not who you think you are. I'm sorry, I'm not following here. Do you know the story of that lost royal family? Yeah, who doesn't know that story? Your DNA matched up with the queen. What? Don't tell me you think I'm royalty. There is no what if. Your DNA lined up perfectly. Just let me see the test. I cannot give this to you. I'm sorry. Why? I it's confidential. You just can't have it. But I need it. If I give you this document, you have to rule. Rule what? You have to give up your everyday life and rule all of us as royalty. I guess I really don't have a choice. Do not tell anyone you got that from me. Okay, I won't. Break in. I'm going to get arrested, thank you. They left the door open? Idiots. Oh, you've gotta be kidding me. Ma'am, what are you doing in here? Um, housekeeping. Yeah, right. Wait, no, please, I can explain. I am a princess. Oh my god, you're right. Your eyes. My eyes? My eyes? What do you mean, my eyes? Come with me right now. We have something to do. Okay. Uh, where are we going? We're going to walk in there and stop the family meeting. Oh, uh, we're going to what? I mean, we can't just barge in that's like rude, right? No, the crown must go to the rightful ruler. <laughs> Everyone, the lost princess has been found. <laughs> Hi. This is ridiculous. I mean, look at the way she's dressed. She's emo. Who says a princess can't be emo? She's not fit to be royalty with that attitude. But look at the color of her eyes. That can't be. They are almost identical to her mother's. Her mother? Guards, I want this girl out of here, right now. I'm going to overrule you guys. You can't just proclaim things like that. Well, I just did. She's kind of badass. Apparently, I am the rightful ruler, and I want to take that place. That's not going to happen. I don't believe you. I need proof. 
Fine, show her my DNA test. But this test says that there's two from the royal bloodline. Two? What do you mean two? Do you have any siblings? Not half ones. Yeah, I have a full sister. There's no way. You both are royalty. What? How is it possible that both of you ended up together? I don't know. We were left on a doorstep. Your sister must agree to rule with you. Mm, there is no way my sister is going to do that. Well, who wouldn't want to be royalty? Her? Yeah, she's kind of a bitch. You must at least try. Okay, but I'm warning you, it's not gonna work. I'll be back in with my sister to overrule you. Whatever, get her out of my sight. Mm -hmm. Sis, I have something to tell you. Okay, that didn't sound good. You know how we were adopted? Yeah, of course. Yes, yeah, so we're actually part of the lost royal family. <laughs> oh, <laughs> I already knew that. I'm sorry, what do you mean that you already knew? Oh, because we were left with a blanket that had the royal crest on it. And you didn't think to tell me at any point? No, because I don't want to be royalty. But you have to be. Where is this all coming from? How did you find out? It's part of my task, okay? We both need the money. Just come with me. We won't need it if we're royalty. I'm so close to finishing, please. Only if you give me 25% of the prize. Fine. Oh, uh, you're back? Yeah, I am. And you brought your sister. Sup, motherfuckers? Tonight we will have the ceremony to officially crown you guys. Tonight? You guys cannot just kick us out <laughs> like this. It's already too late. Congratulations, you are now crowned. This is the craziest thing to ever happen to us. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> Do I have to keep this on like all the time because it really hurts my head? Oh, there you are. Good morning, dork. I am not a dork. Whatever you say. Hey, do you think my new haircut looks dumb? I don't like it. I think it looks really good. Right, you have to say that because you're my best friend. That's not true. You look great. Did you hear that we're getting a new student too? Yeah, we haven't had a new student in so long. <laughs> I know, I wonder who it's gonna be. Class, everyone meet Macy. Whoa, she's so pretty. Yeah, I, I guess so. Hey Macy, you should come over here. Take a seat next to us. Hi guys. Uh, my name's Jason and this is Bailey. Nice to meet you. You should come sit with us at lunch. Would that be okay? Yeah, for sure. Good morning. Uh, you didn't leave a seat open for me. Oh, my bad. I kind of forgot. I'll see you at lunch then? Yeah, yeah, whatever. Macy, what were you saying? Girl, you better tell him that you love him. I don't love him. Are you sure about that? You dropped this. Oh, thank you. I don't even own a TV. Whatever, I guess I'll just throw this away. What is this? I guess the only way to find out is to push one. Now I just have to figure out what that exactly paused. Why did all those people freeze at the exact same time? Does this pause time? Oh, I'm gonna get some good use out of this. Everyone, please put your phones away for the test. I forgot about I know what to do. Just gonna steal the answer key real quick. Don't mind me. Sorry. Play. You may now begin. You have one hour. Hey, uh, can I talk to you? What's up, babe? Yeah, so I'm sorry, but I have to break up with you. What? Mm, just one second. Hey, babe. Oh, uh, hey, what's up? I'm breaking up with you. What? Are you serious? Yeah. Bye. Oh, wow. <sighs> Are you trying something new with your hair? No. What do you mean? Look at yourself. <gasps> what happened to my hair? Honestly, I think it's kind of cool. It looks like a bird's nest. Looks like you have some pink strands of hair now, too. Apparently. I guess it could have been worse. It could have been country. I fell in love with an emo girl. All I want is... Very funny. You know, you kind of look like Machine Gun mm. Kelly, too. Thanks. Why do you look like Hot Topic threw up on you? Guys, okay, it wasn't me. It was my soulmate. I don't want to dress like this. You know, maybe you should. It kind of suits you. Maybe your soulmate just has a crush on Avril Lavigne. That's fair. Me too. Or they might be like a super famous rock star. I really doubt that, but it would be super cool. Guys, is that who I think it is? Looks like your rock star isn't that far away after all. She's back and with more fashion trends from the 2000s that we have to bring back. Listen, hear me out for one second. The denim on denim is kind of hot. I love it. Especially in like this couple's aesthetic and with the necklace, I'm obsessed. I will now be buying a denim corset. Track suits, like why do we ever stop wearing these? They're so cute and you don't have to put any effort in because it already matches. I'm gonna buy this, but in hot pink. 
just everything about Christina Aguilera, the gloves, the chain, the hats, I love the hat. Obviously I already did the braids too. I think they're so cute. Also just everything Avril Lavigne did. Like, are you kidding me? This is the coolest thing I've ever seen. I have these arm cuffs and I bought a tie because of this look. I'm obsessed with cargo pants and I'm very glad that they're coming back into style. Let me know what trends you missed from the 2000s because I have so many more. These are some trends from the 2000s that we need to bring back immediately. First of all, the black and white hair. It's just so good. I wish I could do it, but I'm afraid I'm gonna burn all my hair off. Somebody else needs to eat this up and tag me, please. You might wanna argue with me, but low rise jeans and hear me out. As someone who is not very tall, this makes my torso look so much longer because I have children sized legs. The crimped hair, mwah, mwah. why did we ever stop doing this? I kind of love the texture. It's fun, it's crazy, it's messy, but on purpose. Last but not least, okay, this, this whole aesthetic. The belt and the cargos and the bracelets, yes. I would literally wear this tomorrow if I had all of this. Comment a trend that you wanna see come back. I can't punch someone in the face, that is so mean. Wait, but for a thousand dollars, who's my victim? Hey sis. Uh, yeah, what's up? Remember that one time you stole my white blouse and got hot sauce all over it? Um, yeah, I remember that, I said sorry. It's time for my payback. Dude, you broke my nose! Yes, I'm rich. What's next? I want to buy myself a Chanel bag. You want me to cut someone's ponytail off? I'm sorry, but for 10K, I have to. Mom, I'm so sorry for what I'm about to do. What? What do you mean? Did you just cut all my hair off? Uh, yeah, looks like it. If I have to be bald, so do you. <gasps> I'm sorry. What? I can't do that. I'm gonna get arrested. I'll help you finish the challenge if you give me half the prize money. Hi, beautiful. I'm gonna be doing my whole face of makeup using only filters. Starting with eyebrows using this filter. I feel like my eyebrows are close to this already. <laughs> We're done with brows. Let's move on. You already knew what I was gonna do for contour. My head is definitely a rectangle. I'm built like a Fruit Loops box. This is almost exactly how I normally do it. I feel like it's gonna look really good. Time for some freckles. Let's see what we get. I guess I won't be wearing this makeup outside my house. This is actually not that easy. I picked the random Halloween eyeliner for some spice. Of course it gave me the most difficult one. I have no idea if this looks good or not. I should have done eyeshadow first, but all right. One of my friends just asked me to hang out. Uh, not right now. Lastly, we are doing some random lips. Come on. Should I send a picture to my crush like this? Okay, and this is our final look from all of those filters combined. I don't know how I feel about this. I don't think I'm gonna go outside the house. I kind of killed it. I think I did a good job. Hey, who's that girl over there? Oh, her? We call her Silent Beauty. She can't say anything. Why don't we go say hi? No, you cannot be seen with her. Whatever, guys. Hey, uh, my name's Ethan. I really like your hair. You remind me of the purple Teletubby. So, let me guess, you don't have any words. Uh, don't worry, I can speak for you then. Oh, hell no, you did not bring her over here. She is not sitting with us. Why not? She's cool. No, she's not. She's just a weirdo. Wait, whoa, 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 don't leave. I'll come sit with just you instead, not them. I just wish you could speak up for yourself. She's awful. You're the only person who's ever been nice to me. Whoa, what? You can speak? I thought you had zero words. No, I have infinite. What? You have infinite words? But everyone thinks you can't speak. I convinced everybody that I didn't have any words, but I do. But why won't you talk to anyone if you have words? Do you see how mean they are? I've been recording them. Recording them? What are you gonna do with it? Don't worry about it. How long have you been doing this? It started freshman year. I decided I was not gonna speak at all. And no one ever figured you out? Nope, they're kind of dumb. You can't tell anyone that I can actually speak, okay? I promise I am not going to. Do you want to help me expose them? Expose them like how? I know all their secrets because they think I can't tell anybody. Would we be like Bonnie and Clyde then? Yeah, I guess you could say that. This sounds like fun. Deal. Deal. Wait, what even is your name? It's Bailey. That's pretty. How are we gonna do this? Don't worry, I already have it figured out. I can take your order when you're ready. Can I just get a number six? Of course, is that all? Yeah. Uh, we give out a free dum-dum with each order. Thanks. Hey, what can I- wait, weren't you here yesterday too? You remember me? I don't think I could forget. Let me guess, you want to get a number six. How did you know? I have no idea. It must have been <laughs> luck. 
And here's your dum dum. Have a good day. Thank you. Oh, look, it's my favorite customer. Stop, you're making me blush. So, what's your name? If you don't mind that, I'm asking. It's Bailey. I don't mind. My name's Lucas. You should try the number one instead. It's my favorite. You know what? Sure. Enjoy the dum dum and have a good day. You too. I can help who's next? Oh, hi, where's Lucas? He moved to a different location. He doesn't work here anymore. Um, do you think you could tell me the new location that he works at? No, I can't disclose that information. Sorry. Could you move if you don't mind? There's people in line behind you. Wait, but what about the free dum-dum with each order? I'm sorry, we don't do that here. I'm never going to be able to find him again. There's like 300 locations just in my area. Are you excited to start your new job today? Yes, I can't wait to meet everyone. You'll be amazing, don't worry. Thanks. Hi everyone, welcome to your first day on the job. I'll give you guys a few minutes to get to know your coworkers. Um, excuse me, have we met before? I'm not sure, I don't think so. I'm sorry, it's just that you look really familiar for some reason. Maybe we met before or something. Well, anyway, my name is Bailey. I go by my middle name, Will. It's nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Okay, everybody, it's time to get started with the work day. See you later. Yeah, of course. Whoa, did you design that by yourself? Uh, yeah, I did. It's beautiful. You have a lot of talent. Thank you. I appreciate that. Now that I think of it, I definitely remember you from somewhere. I'm sure we'll figure it out at some point. Hopefully. This is going to bother me for the rest of the day. We were lucky enough today to get a catered lunch for every single one of you. <gasps> they have dum-dums! <laughs> Um, Bailey, is something wrong? Lucas? 